A suspected Grinch is off the streets just in time for Christmas. We've told you about a rise in holiday package thefts throughout the area, and now police have arrested one man they say is responsible for at least 40 of those thefts. ABC7 is fighting back with Jennifer Donnell. She's live in Arlington tonight with how police got uh, the one man responsible for this crime spree. Well, you know, Maureen, many residents said, well, we don't think police really take this crime seriously. Think again. This is what they said they heard as they were had this whole area under surveillance. They said that drew them over to the suspect. They said this alleged Christmas Grinch was shopping. He'd go through a package, say, no, I don't want the scarf. Hmm. Rum cake, no. Cell phone, yeah, definitely taking that. For weeks, residents in the D.C. metro area have been trying to fight back against these thieves of opportunity who snatch packages off of front porches. Now meet 22-year-old Keith Morris. Police say he's a one-man crime wave. Clearly, this is a, an example of a Grinch that tried to steal Christmas. And try he did, successfully, to the tune of at least 40 packages so far in Arlington over several months. This was really kind of an outrageous one. According to police, Moore's real job was contract work for concierge services at several apartment buildings in the area. Oh, really? Wow, that's sad. Called in the backup. There was four cars showed up. They took fingerprints. All that police attention Nels Anderson said three weeks ago after he found two missing packages on North Vermont Street, including one of his own with $450 worth of fishing equipment inside. He took a $3 item out of it and threw the rest of it behind the trash can and sat there for four days. Uh, one of my neighbors found like five or six packages over in an alley over there. And Omar Terry lives in the same complex. His package was tossed. The contents were left untouched. A lot of candy. So this guy apparently did not have a sweet tooth. No, not a sweet tooth. With packages disappearing and even reappearing all torn up, Arlington County police officers went undercover yesterday and said they captured more in action, charging him with larceny, credit card fraud, credit card theft, even identity theft. I'm really glad they caught the guy. You know, it's good news. Merry Christmas. Well, thank you. Well, ABC7 is on your side. There is an app out there called Next Door App where neighbors help neighbors, and you can use this app to perhaps hit up a neighbor and ask them, will they be home to take a package? Now, many people asking us, so let's say your rum cake was stolen, and how do you get it back from Arlington County Police? Well, make sure you file that theft report. They're going to be checking, cross-checking the items with what they found with the items that have been reported stolen. Reporting live from Arlington, I'm Jennifer Donnell in ABC7 News. Thank you, Jennifer.